Howdy, folks. I am very happy to report that the transparent hand condoms are a thing of the past, and I found myself a decent pair of real rubber gloves to wear for these Ashens pastiches. Yay, we can bring back this old tradition, except for this collapsing pinky thing. I don't know what the deal is with that. But anyways, hooray for proper PPE. That's personal protective equipment for those of you who don't speak industrial lease. Now, now that this rubber gloves, this proper rubber gloves tradition has been brought back, let's bring back another tradition of these Ashens pastiches, dollar store merchandise. Because I found my way to the dollar store for the first time in however long it's been. What we're making fun of today should resonate with fans of the TV show Family Guy. Remember the episode where Brian the dog was going around trying to sell those like holiday sausage things and he had that line, Excuse me, would you like to taste my smoked meat log? Well, as I was perusing the offerings in the dollar store, I noticed a little something that kind of reminded me of that whole smoked meat log thing, without actually being a smoked meat log. And as you can tell already, it has a wrapper. Ladies and gentlemen, feast your eyes on Pearson's Salted Nut Roll. <laughs> This was a day one buy the minute I saw it. Classic dollar store candy. Excuse me, would you like to have a salted nut roll? Like they can bite out of the salted nut roll? <laughs> I just can't continue this. Uh, okay, all you people that didn't grow up after middle school, it's time to start growing up. Uh, wait a minute, this is actually a king size salted nut roll. Excuse me, would you like to try my king size salted nut roll? <laughs> what are we dealing with here? Hmm, ingredients, peanuts, bolded, of course, in case somebody's allergic to it or whatever. Sugar, corn syrup, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Allergy information, manufactured on shared equipment with tree nuts. Uh-oh, our old warning yet again. Distributed by the Pearson Candy Company, St. Paul, Minnesota. Now, one of the things that I'm thinking of with this salted nut roll <laughs> thing is that maybe in another world where lawyers won't be like threatening to do stuff you know this could be called a payday bar because it kind of does sort of look like you know the sort of it does look kind of like look like a sort of lawyer avoiding lawsuit avoiding version of a payday bar or something like that but anyways here it is the king size salted nut roll now let's bust this thing open Ooh, crunchy salty sweet and chewy Let's see exactly how right I am with this guess that this is basically some kind of payday bar type thing. Okay, let's just get the salted nut roll. Oof, the salted nut roll is kind of stuck. Oof. Let me guess, you're supposed to seek immediate medical help if it takes you longer than four hours to eat one of these things. <laughs> Anyways, yes, it does kind of sort of look like a payday bar. <laughs> oh, man. So, my biggest concern about this is that <laughs> this will end up like those Spurlari nugget bars that wound up in Job Lot all those years ago, and it was really hard, or so they hardened up in the ship or something. Fortunately, it looks like my salted nut roll here is very, very flexible. <laughs> <laughs> All right, <laughs> this will obviously be done off camera. Pearson salt the original king size salted nut roll in three, two, one, point seven five, point five, point two five. Okay, heck with it. Oh. And look what's in the middle. Yeah, tastes pretty decent, actually. Not bad for dollar store candy. So, uh, yeah, a little bit of salt, obviously. A little bit of sweetness. Crunchy and chewy, yeah, it is kind of a mix. It is basically everything that it advertised itself as. So, yay. It's basically the funnier version of a payday bar. <laughs> oh, man. Decent stuff, though. Alright. it's enough of that thing. So, yeah. 
Now, not everything in a dollar store has to be cheesy or bad or anything. This is actually quite decent. Maybe next time I'm in a convenience store, I should compare the $1 price of this salted nut roll to whatever real payday bars cost and see if maybe there's more bang for buck in one of these things. Either way, if you're looking for a snack to get your inner middle school kid cracking up all over the place, this is what you're looking for. <laughs> Oh, for Pete's sake, I'm too old for this kind of stuff. Why do I still find it funny? All juvenile stuff aside, perhaps the best thing about salted nut rolls is that apparently salted nut rolls are gluten-free 